Well, five schools in the Hickman Mills School District have new principals this year. The changes are part of the new superintendent's plan to regain full accreditation and attract more families. Lisa Benson is live. She sat down with the superintendent today to talk about his plan. The district superintendent says they are working very hard towards full accreditation, and this is at least part of the reason why. The Cerner Corporation has bought this land and will bring 15,000 new jobs to the area, and the district wants to make sure they are ready for those families. One, two, three. Two. Great Good job. job. There were lots of photo ops. One, two, three. And encouraging words as kindergartners and the district's new superintendent settled in. A great start, but the key, of course, is how we how we finish. Good job. Good job. Shortly after taking over in April, Dr. Dennis Carpenter informed his administrators they would have to reapply for their jobs. Some quit, others weren't rehired. We've hired five new principals in the district. And we've also brought in some central office leaders from various places. Changes some parents welcome. They want the district to regain full accreditation. I think that's good, actually, because the district hasn't been the best. Um, so I think a change is good. I think it's a big major thing for our children to be properly educated. The Cerner Corporation recently announced plans to build a new 236-acre office park at the old Bannister Mall site. Carpenter wants those employees to send their children to his schools. There's a lot of energy in the district around improvement related to that whole topic of Cerner and its real Carpenter also in our plans community. to use technology upgrades to help students succeed, including Twitter. If you'd like to follow the district, you can do so at HMC1 Hard Work. Reporting live, Lisa Benson, 41 Action News.